everybody. Post festival party? I thought this thing was over. I think they got one more thing. Nobody invited you to it, so let's just go home. Huh? Hey, Kasumi, what's up, girl? Senpai, aren't you going to the post festival party? I think I might, yeah. I'm not sure yet. Then why don't we go together? Oh, you invited me on the date, girl? Okay. Festivals don't come around every day, so we may as well enjoy it while we can. Yes, that's true. You don't get to experience this every every year. <laughs> it seems like it's already begun. Let's get in there, senpai. All right, Kasumi, let's do this. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Hey, dance dance revolution style. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's that game? Uh, Persona Dance, I think is what they got it. This is promotion for Persona Dance, baby. <laughs> Just standing around while everyone dances is embarrassing. Senpai, let's do it. All right, then. It's showtime. I can tell she's being she's holding herself back. Okay, there you go, Joker. <laughs> <Very impressive. laughs> He's enjoyed himself. There we go. Hey, you're Yoshizawa's son, right? The first year, we've got a little favor to ask you. Oh, what's this now? Got it. I'm in. Oh, what is it? What you got to do? Oh, I'm excited for this one. Senpai, I'll be back soon. They've asked me to help them with something. Just All right. Watch what happens. All right, then. Okay, there you go, Yoshizawa. There you go. That's crazy. It is. <laughs> there you go, Yoshizawa. There you go, girl. There you go. I, I left the party with Kasumi to cool off a bit outside. That was 
so exhausting, but what a blast. I feel like I danced my heart out back there. Yeah, that, I could tell. I could tell. Thank you. Wow, that dance was amazing. I know, right? I was totally blown away. <laughs> Uh, she's getting embarrassed. It's fun. Uh, it's my dad. He's telling me to come home before it gets too late. Sorry to leave you like this, but I have to get going. It's all cool, Kasumi. Nice talking to you. Be careful heading home. I will. Please excuse me. The post festival party was so much fun, especially with you. See you soon. The gym's quieted down. Looks like the dance is over. I'd have head home. The post festival party is about to begin. Would you like to go together? I tried to think about what happened early, but that has gotten me nowhere. So I could change a pace. I could change a pace. I think I should go to post part of Haru. Oh, we're hanging with Haru now? I want to date with Makoto! Alright, that was a great performance by the dance club! Dang it! Everybody give them another round of applause! <sighs> Aw, I wanted to hang with Makoto! I mean, Haru's not bad, but... Dang it, y'all. I'm sorry. I can't stop thinking about what Akechi-kun said. It'll be alright, it'll be alright. <laughs> It feels like nothing bad could ever happen when you say that. <laughs> and now it's time for your favorite shooting tradition, the student sharing special. Round of applause, everyone. Sharing? I never knew we had such an event. All right, who has something to say? Anyone? Anyone? No? I'll just have to pick someone then. Oh, he's going to choose? I wonder who it will be. Oh, I wonder who. How about that fluffy hair girl over there? I choose you. Ha <laughs> ha! Huh? Is he looking this way? Well then, come on up. He's talking to me, isn't he? Yep, you're up. So it really is me. Ha ha ha! Yep. Um, yes. Ah, this one's different. He's not as engaged as he was with Makoto, but he's curious. He was engaging with Makoto, but this one, he is very conservative right now. This guy, oh, I will take it back. This is actually kind of fun to look up now. Ha ha ha! Oh, wow! This is a different question altogether. Oh. So, are they from Shujin? What do you think, Okumura-san? Uh. Haru's in trouble. I need to change the subject. Well. Oh, I could totally go that. Huh? <laughs> I love this so far.
The guy standing up, yeah, it sure was me. <laughs> it sure does sound like it. Ah, uh, you say that. Did you all enjoy our blushing beauty? Thank you very much, Okumura san. Just when it was getting interesting, she did her job. First festival party is finally over. <laughs> it turned out to be more like an interview party, huh? I still can't believe you said that. Hey, what can I say? I was very inter I was very much wanted to get involved in this. I couldn't just ignore you. Huh? Right. At any rate, I'm not sure what I would have done without you. No problem. Thank you for saving me. You're a mysterious person, but you're so reliable. I think the two of us will get along quite well in the future. I think we'll become good friends. We won't get as long as you, I'm sorry, but you won't get as long as me and Makoto would. But you will definitely get along. <laughs> as they say, who knows what may lie ahead? For now, I'm worried about what happened with Akechi-kun. But I have to say, my first post-festival party was quite fun. Though, I guess it's my last too. Yeah. Sex. Here, I'd like you to have this. Sakura Amezaki? I bought it earlier. It looks delicious. <laughs> now then, let's go home. Ah uh, yes, yeah, speaking of home, we gotta deal with Sojiro. Happy Halloween. Oh, yeah, it's almost October 31st in this game. It's funny how in real life we're in November and this game is October. Welcome home. Hey, what's up, Futaba? You off somewhere during the festival, huh? I tried to find you, but I gave up pretty quickly. Eh, that sounds about right for you. Futaba? What are you doing here in front of the store? I needed to calm my brain. My thoughts were getting out of hand. Uh, if you came here to calm yourself down, you're going to be in for a big Not surprise. Not just but other stuff too. We're in deep trouble unless we can do something soon. But anyway, I was just thinking about going inside, so your timing is perfect. Let's go. The mass media has been causing quite a commotion lately. Yep. Now back to this asshole. No countermeasure for the phantom thieves, the sorry state of the police, destruction of safety. Yada yada yada. They're saying whatever they want. So, how's the investigation progressing? Any clues yet? Nothing that leads to a firm conviction yet. What's going on here? Didn't you say that you were sure about closing this case? And I thought I told you that failure won't be tolerated. And it's bad enough that the media is already scrutinizing and getting down on the uh, public safety. But even the boss is also doing this too. And we all know what the boss's motive and reason is for this. She will fake it. I mean, she, with all of this piling down on her, no wonder they would have her faking a, a, a confession. She, this stuff is beyond her control, and y'all acting like she's responsible for this? She'll just shift the responsibility to someone else. She's shoving one responsibility to another person, and that person shoving it to someone else? It's just crazy, man. Well, this is troublesome. If things continue at this rate, never mind the promotion. We'd have to let you go entirely. Oh, wow. Are you serious? But, sir... I had high expectations for you. But it seems this task was too much to handle for someone so young. We may need to reform the operation as well. 
since the selected personnel for this. Please, let me see this through to the end. This case is something that I've always... I know that you've been at this for a while now. Even before the police spared us the staff for it. If you can manage an arrest, I've made special arrangements so that you can question them personally. He's basically just writing it down, just fake a conviction. I mean, fake a confession or fake a sol solidification evidence that they did it. He's just asking for pin the blame on the Phantom Thieves at this point. That's what you want, isn't it? The leadership of this country is about to change. We can't let this case carry over into their term. I'll make myself clear again. Failure isn't an option. We need results. I understand. Yes, so do I. You're allowed to take some bold measures if you need to. We need good results, no matter what. Oh, one more thing. If the unexpected happens to occur, contact me immediately. To you, sir? Yeah, that's a little odd. I said that failure isn't an option, didn't I? Yes. Everything is proceeding as planned. Yeesh, that face. <laughs> Sojiro? Speaking of faces. I was cleaning up and found this. Uh-oh. <gasps> this is a calling card, right? I read about it online, too. Y you went into my room without my permission? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You He would need to ask your permission in a house that he owns? Really, Futaba? I'll apologize as much as you want later. Kids these days, man, think they own some shit. So, what is this? I think they entitled to some stuff. Bruh. Why did you have why does she have that? Is it something to get flustered over? Oh shoot, yeah, that that's already. I knew it. This isn't just some game you're playing. He knows. Why aren't you saying anything? Yeah, Futaba, speak up! Why did you keep it? I mean, it was memorable. Yeah, that's a bit... Memory is not a good thing right now. Explain. Explain. Uh-oh. Can't tell me? Uh-oh. She's about to go on a mental breakdown, and we are going to be freaking losing it. If this keeps up, Futaba's... I'll explain everything. I'm talking to Futaba here, you know. Oh, he's not having it. I'll get right to the point. Oh, he's not having none of it. Is this a real one? Did they trigger a change of heart in you? <laughs> How about it? Oh, bro, it's picking things up quickly. He's seeing the numbers add up, and he, we, I'm not liking what he's going to find. Ever since Mom died, I, there was n no exit. I was trapped in, in a labyrinth of my heart. I knew I had to leave it, but I, I couldn't do it by myself. Futaba. Here, sit down. I can at least listen to what you have to say. Oh, he looks like he calmed down a bit. The Phantom Thieves saved me. They stole my messed up heart. It's the same as Mom's research. They changed my cognition. Is he getting any of that? Seriously? I don't know if he is or not. Akaba's research about altering one's cognition. I wondered about it myself, too. Still. He didn't believe it until now. When did you notice? 
when she said she was going to go to the beach out of nowhere. And even the doctors had thrown in the towel. Yeah, an introvert like her who stays all her time in her room suddenly wants to go to the beach with us. Oh, yeah, no. No, that's red flags all the way. Not, not red flags. That's alarming flags, I think it's the word. At first, I just chalked it up as other kids being a better support for you than any adult. But as I kept watching the tabloid shows here day in and day out, a thought crossed my mind. I thought your case kind of seemed similar to what these phantom thieves were doing. Yeah. Wow. I'm still your guardian, you know. I'd never overlook such a drastic change in your behavior. Yeah, he picked up on some stuff pretty... Sojiro. But to think that Wakaba's research of the Phantom Thieves changing hearts about the same thing. Back in the day, I used to be a government official. My job was to be the bridge between the country and the lab that Wakaba worked at. It's around that time that I got to know her. Wow. She said something odd when we were out drinking. That one of these days, she might die a bizarre death. Who wouldn't take that as a joke? I just laughed it off. Dang. I think she might have took it as a joke at first, but slowly came to realize it was going to be true. But it happened exactly as she said. And you were left flabbergasted, weren't you? If anything were to happen to you, I'd feel like I let her down. There's something I want to ask you. What's up, man? From your attitude, you knew about this calling card, didn't you? Then he probably knows we're involved too. You should have known that Futaba had a change of heart through the Phantom Thieves as well. Uh oh. Is there a connection between you and them? Are you asking, are we involved with the Phantom Thieves, or we know the Phantom Thieves? The first incident of a change of heart was a teacher at your school. Uh oh. The kid who brought that painting here was a pupil of that artist who had a change of heart, wasn't he? He's picking the pieces. And then there's Futaba. Yeah, he knows. He's like, there's too many connections with you involved. Ain't no way you have no uh, involvement with the Phantom Thieves. You always seem to be linked to these incidents somehow. Got anything to say? Uh, first it was a catchy and now it's so true. Why are, and the police questioned us earlier too and knew that we were involved with Kamoshida. We had a run-in with Kamoshida and we have a, uh, a record. How did the police not figure this out? Now I'm thinking about it. You're quite sharp, unlike everybody else around here. You think this is a game? I do not. You but I'm also not. People call them criminals. Why did you introduce such dangerous people to Futaba? That's not true. I asked them. That's why he saved me. He stole my heart. Sounds like a love confession right there. Asked? Stole? Uh, um. And she's not helping the cause at all. Wait, are you saying that he's the one who changed your heart? Oh, he didn't know we were Phantom Thieves. He just thought we knew him. Oh, shoot. Wow, thanks, Futaba. You just threw us completely out there. He doesn't just deal with the Phantom Thieves. He's actually one of them. Oh, Sojiro, please don't throw me out, man. Please don't throw me out, Sojiro. <laughs> You're pulling my leg, aren't you? This is no joke. I am a phantom thief. Are you serious? Sojiro, please calm down, bro. Please don't freak out. You really are a phantom thief? Oh, for crying out loud. Sojiro... Sojiro is not going to have any of this. So, basically, I've been sheltering a phantom thief for the last six months. And on top of that, Futaba's involved too. Futaba is a phantom thief, by the way. What the hell? He's like, man, I was just running a cafe, bruh. Now I got this to deal with in my house, in my roof? Who killed my mom? 
Wait, killed? Bro, we're throwing so much at Sojiro right now, and I don't know if this is the right time to do it. Well, this is the right time. I don't know if he's ready for it. She was killed. I remember it now. Stop this nonsense. Why won't you believe me? Are you the same as everyone else? Well, it's hard to imagine that. He can't even wrap his head around the fact that we're phantom thieves. Now you're trying to bring in the mom's death was a murder situation. He, he's trying to just trying to get what's going on right now. Didn't you know already? The way mom died wasn't normal. Didn't you notice that her research was stolen by someone? Sojiro. When she passed away, I did think it was odd. It was awfully fishy. But what could I do? All I was able to do was run from it all. Run away, hide, and end up here as some old guy running a cafe. To be frank, I took you in for my own good. Like it'd somehow make up for what I'd done. It's basically my fault that you got burdened with all this crap. Fault though. You weren't responsible for his her mom's death. You had no power in this whatsoever. It's not your fault, Sojiro. I acted all big, lectured, even yelled at you kids. I mean, you have experience and knowledge we don't, so I can't say you weren't putting your uh, information, putting your uh, experience out there for us to listen. And I end up getting consoled by her. God, real pathetic, aren't I? Not even close, man. It's not even close. I mean, the one who killed mom's the one at fault. <sighs> I see. He's taking this way better than I thought. Don't worry. Even if you are the real Phantom Thieves, I have no intention of reporting or kicking you out. I mean, who would believe such a story? Shoot. Unless no idea. red-handed, it's impossible to explain that you're the Phantom Thieves. Oh yeah, that's true. Now, Akechi does have strong ties to that. Akechi does have some strong evidential proof. You, on the other hand, yeah. Let me just say one thing, though. Immediately back out of a fight that you can't win. What? What do you mean? Don't you get it? If, by chance, you pissed off the same guys that killed Wakaba... He's coming at someone that kids like you can deal with. Listen to reason, alright? I mean, I'm afraid we can't do that right now. We're pretty much wanted criminals right now. And as for pissing off the person who killed Wakaba, I'm pretty sure it's the same person. I have a strong suspicion. We're done talking about this. Come on. Time to eat. All that yelling's gotten me hungry. All that, all this listening has gotten me tired, bruh. After all of this, I gotta take a rest. Whew. If he turned us in, that would have jeopardized our operation. Yeah, and freaking would have got me a second strike on my probation. Still, we should tell the others about what just happened. Oh, I'm tired. You have no idea how accurate that is right now, Futaba. What? He knows everything? You've got to be fucking kidding. Wait, are you okay? Did he report you to or anything? We likely wouldn't be receiving these messages if Akira was not okay. I had a feeling that boss was or or no ordinary man. Yeah, he was very sharp for a cafe clerk. But he didn't recommend you to turn. He didn't recommend you turn yourself in, did he? I think in that case we can consider him a new ally. I'm more curious about what he mentioned to you. You mean how our enemy might be the same people who target Futaba's mother? Yeah, she was killed by mental shutdown, the same method used by the culprit we pursue now. Wait, on second thought, didn't you say Boss had to run from it all? Does that mean someone was trying to stop the news from getting out? Who could do that? Who do you think is who do you think the culprit could be? 
It's gotta be some government official. Ain't you letting your imagination run a bit wild? I mean, who has that type of power in the in the country? But it would make sense. Wait a sec. If you're right, then someone then wouldn't the police be working for him too? That's not possible. That's not impossible. It's very high chance they got some f cops working under them. This is getting too big for me to even think about. Can we really win this? We're gonna win. I guess the chief had an inkling after all. Sorry. It's my fault. All this happened because I kept call. I kept the calling card. <sighs> it's so late already. Uh it says you're still awake. This is kind of awkward. Go home or he'll worry for real. I'm gonna go home. Night. All right. With that being taken care of, we're gonna head on to. We're gonna head off to bed. Let's call it a day and go to bed. Yeah, we're gonna head to sleep now. Anyway, that's probably gonna end today's video. Uh, so. We got to go to the school festival, see the school festival part two or day two. Got to hang with Kasumi and Haru afterwards. I was a little bummed I didn't get a ch chance to hang with Makoto, but hanging with Haru was a pretty interesting event. But then we got home, Sojiro confronted us about the calling card, about Futaba. He, we le he learned we're the Phantom Thieves. He was, a real more, he was a lot more sharp than anyone else, I'll give him that. And we also... Might have found out that the person who has killed Futaba's mom, Wakaba, might also uh, might also be running in with uh, who might be also the ones who's targeting us right now and pinning the blame on this. Oh yes, and of course this S the SIU director is trying to force Nijiba to get the Phantom Thieves confession, even if she's got to fake it. So everything is going according to their plans, and our plans are still running amok. And Akechi is trying to get us to join him. Because Akechi found out that we're the Phantom Thieves. So everything is just going crazy in these past couple of minutes. Ah, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what we're going to do. But we're going to end the video here. Don't. That's going to end today's video, y'all. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Let me know on the channel what you liked about this video. What you didn't like about this video. Let me know Let me know what else you want to play on here. Your opinions do matter. You, your opinions do mean something to me. For anyone who does watch this and listen to this. After we get done at a certain point of this, we're going to go back to Ruby Arrowfell because that game came out of yesterday and I got a little play up through of it. So hopefully we'll get to have some fun of that. Get back to Genshin Impact because this had like seven updates since the last I played it. But uh, this is all but all that will be coming later on later on the year later, or early next year. I don't know. But that's going to end today's video, y'all. So I'm going to sign out. Until then, this is KJ. See you all in the next video.